Hello developers, today we are going to build an Android based AR application. By the end of this video, you will have a working model that you can customize and use in your own projects. AR Core app allows users to experience augmented reality on their Android devices. This kit helps developers and users to experience their own 3D models in their Android devices. You will also build a similar solution today. We'll be using a candy kit to build this solution. Now what is a candy kit? Candy one click install kit gives you ready to deploy solution with a complete source code. You can access many more such ready to use candy kits on augmented reality, artificial intelligence, blockchain, gaming and many more on candy. Today we'll be using a popular candy kit which is AR experience for Android one click install kit. Now this kit is open source and comes with a permissive license. That means you can freely edit, customize and share your own solution. Let's get started then. Over to you Rajeshwari for a hands-on walkthrough. Hello everyone. Hope you all are excited to build your own Android based AR application. Recent times I could hear some sounds of mind blowing technology which revolutioning both present and future. That is none other than the immersive technologies. Immersive technologies which include AR, VR and Metaverse among us the fastest growing and fascinating technologies to do. To build this AR application, you will be required the following. Initially, pick a development environment of a choice to develop and debug the code. And come up with the exciting 3D models which we are going to experience in the augmented reality. And finally, you will be required some basic knowledge to handle the Android application. Everything you need is already available in the candy kit. Great. Let's get started by installing Candy One Click Kit. Check the description for the link to be installable. It will navigate you to the respective Candy One Click Kit page. And here you could see this download One Click Installer. While hitting this button, it will set up a working sandbox application with all needed prerequisites and resources. Now you could follow the Git deployment instruction for the installation process. And you could have a glance on the libraries added in the above session, which will be very helpful in exploring the application. Now take a pass on the video, complete the installation process and hit resume button. Right now we'll jump into the development of the code. Great, hope you all are set. Once you successfully completed the installation process, get the project to the respective ID. Place the 3D model under this sample data folder. Now we could check the code what was written in this main activity. Initially, create a local variable for AR fragment and model renderable. And inside this onCreate method, we could initialize the AR fragment and get the support fragment manager by using the ID of the fragment. To make the application very simple, we have divided this application into three simple methods. One is up model and another one is up plane and one more is on create method. In this setup model method, we could create this model renderable in which the 3D model and all related resources which will be loaded in the background. And this error message is to show whether the error occurs or not. Coming to the setup plane method, and this method is used to check if the user has anchored that detected scene, then it returns the hit result. Using this, we will be able to attach our model to the custom node. And from here, we are calling this third method, which is this create model method. And in this method, finally, we will write the code to add the node to the model renderer, which we created in the first method. Finally, we can see the fragment get initialized, the model get loaded and attached the scene to the node. And this is how this Android AR application is built. Great. Hope you all are set. Once you successfully completed the installation process, get the APK file to the respective Android. Download the APK file and install it. Once the installation completed, open the application. Allow the needed permissions. Now once it found the surface, we could see some dots on it. Now we can place the 3D model, we can maximize it, we can zoom it, we can rotate it. We can place the 3D model wherever we want. Coming to interesting part of the session, we are going to customize this Android application with our favorite 3D models.
get your 3d models from any open source website now we are going to customize the wolf 3d model and this is a 3d model which i am going to customize here just copy this 3d models and place it over the sample data folder and now in our android ide we could see this three 3d models properties are added now just rebuild the application now we could see this application is rebuilding it will redirect you to the respective apk folder and here you could download this folder to your android and restart the application and this is how we can customize the android application once we successfully added the customized 3d model rebuild the application and download the apk folder open the file and start the installation process now we can open the folder allow the needed permissions place the phone over the surface now we could see the customized 3d model as the output similarly we can up rotate the 3d model zoom it out and zoom it in congrats now you have your own customized android ar application hope you found this session useful you can find the link to the ar experience for android kit and many other ready to deploy kits in the description head over to candy to build incredible projects on augmented reality artificial intelligence blockchain gaming and many more try out candy kits now hit that subscribe button and join us at the open viva community of developers to learn more and build many more incredible projects thank you for watching this session till the next one bye bye